What's up guys, this is Massey, welcome to another video. In this video I want to show you the isomers of octane. And octane is C8H18. And we have 18 structural isomers for octane. The first one is gonna be normal octane or N-octane with E. Gonna be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And these are all surrounded by hydrogen atoms. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, and eighteen. So there is no branch here, we have just the main branch. Second one is gonna be two methyl heptane. 2-methylheptane, we have the main branch here with 7 carbons and we have methyl group in here. Number 3 is going to be 3-methylheptane. It's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Very similar to the previous one, but the methyl group, the location is different. It's going to be on the third one. 1, 2, 3. So we start numbering from this side. 1, 2, 3. So that's why we have 3 methyl heptane. We have heptane because we have 7 carbons on the main branch. Number 4 is going to be 4 methyl heptane which is going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and we have methyl group on the fourth one number 5 obviously we cannot have 5 methyl heptane because if we go one more it means that we need to start numbering from the other side from this side so it's going to be 3 methyl heptane which we already counted Next one is going to be 3 ethyl hexane. So we have one ethyl group basically. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and we have 3 ethyl. So these are the hydrogen atoms. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 14, 15, 16, 17, and 18. Next one, instead of ethyl group, we can have 2-methyl group, which is going to be 2 and 2 dimethyl hexane. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 2 and 2, it's going to be like that. So we have 2 and 2 dimethyl hexane next one is going to be 2 and 3 dimethyl hexane which is going to be 6 carbons on the main branch 2 and 3 it's going to be like that 2 and 3 dimethyl hexane this is number 7 number 8 it's going to be 2 and 4 dimethyl select the previous one dimethyl hexane which is going to be 1 2 3 4 5 6 so 2 and 4 methyl One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Number 9 will be 2 and 5 dimethyl hexane. So again, we have 6 carbon atoms in here, in second, and the fifth one has carbon atoms. This is carbon number 2. And here, this one is going to be carbon number 5. Number 10 is going to be 3 and 3 
dimethyl hexane. So we have two methyl group both on the third carbon. Which is going to be in here and it's going to be in here as well. So we have two methyl groups on the third carbon. Number 11. It's going to be 3 and 4 dimethyl hexane. Six carbons here. Three and four. It's going to be the number 11 isomers. Number 12. Number 12, we can say it can be 3 ethyl, 2 methyl, pentane. So we have five carbons in here. 3 ethyl and 2 methyl. This is the second one, this is the third one. Ethyl comes first because E is prior comparing to M because of the alphabetical order. So that's why we have 3 ethyl, 2 methyl pentane. Number 13, we have 3-ethyl, 3-methyl, pentane. It means that we have 5 carbon atoms in here. We have ethyl in here and we have, actually it's going to be on the third one, so it's going to be like that. So we have one ethyl group and one methyl group on the third one. That's why it's called 3-ethyl, th 3-methyl pentane. Isomer number 14 will be 2, 2, and 3, trimethyl pentane. which will be five carbons like that. And we have carbon in here, carbon here, and one carbon in here. Methyl group on the third one, and two methyl groups on the second carbon. So we have five carbons in here, two and two and three, trimethyl pentane. Isomer number 15 is going to be one, two, three, four, five. We have two methyl on the second and one methyl on the fourth carbon. So it's going to be two and this one is going to be four. So two and two and four. I'm going to write it here. Two and two and four. Trimethyl pentane. Number 16 is going to be two 3, 3, trimethyl pentane. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 2, 3, and 3. So we have two methyl groups on the third carbon and one methyl group on the second carbon here. Isomer number 17 is going to be 2. 3 and 4 trimethyl pentane 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 so we have 3 methyl groups on the 2nd and the 3rd and on 4th carbon atoms and finally the last one number 18 is going to be uh, two and two, three and three, tetra methyl butane. Should be one, two, three, and four. We have two methyl groups here and two methyl groups in here. One, two, 
three and four. So that's why we have two and two, three and three, tetra, methyl, butane. So these are all 18 isomers of octane. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave me a comment if you have any question and I get back to you as soon as possible. Thank you for watching and have a great day.